I wanted to show you guys these rascally dogs. This is my dog Lucius, right here, and then this is my dad's dog Kona. And they're both standard poodles, and they're pretty rascally dogs. But we're dog sitting Kona right now, and basically they're making my life crazy because Kona likes to bark a lot and drives my baby nuts, makes my baby crazy. So it's been an adventure dog sitting. <laughs> but. Yeah, you know, it's an adventure, and my dad appreciates it, so it is what it is. I wanted to kind of do a review of some things that I've been eating and really enjoying in my weight loss journey, and I worked out today, and I'm feeling so motivated, and I'm really quite pumped. Like, I feel like I can really do this, and it's making me really excited, and I actually really love the Facebook community that goes along with the YouTube weight loss community. And if anyone's not a part of the weight loss community on uh, Facebook, let me know and I'll add you. I'm also going to put my Facebook and YouTube, or not YouTube, my Facebook and Twitters in my um, underbar. So if anyone wants to add me on either of those, you can. I've been doing a lot of, uh, like on Twitter, the pound sweaty face. I don't know if you guys know about that. I think uh, Nicole Ceramic Heart started that quite a while ago. but. Basically, you take a picture of your sweaty face and post it on Twitter, and I really love doing it. It's kind of a motivating thing for me. So if you go on there, you'll see a few of my sweaty faces. But I think that's a lot of fun, so I think you guys ought to get on it and do that too. But I'll go ahead and show you guys these products I've been using with my eating and kind of what I'm doing to help me keep on track. So the first thing I want to show you were these tortillas. <coughs> um, let's see, Marissa and Mommy, I think is her YouTube name. She actually posted a video about these, but I'd been using them for a long time. When I was pregnant with my recent baby, who's a little over three months old, I was diagnosed with gestational diabetes, and in order to help me control the diabetes, I had to really watch what I was eating. So I found these at Costco, and they're a little different tasting, I'll be honest. Uh, they're pretty weedy, but I actually really like them. They've got 12 grams of fiber, so they're really high fiber, and um, they're great. Uh, for one of these, and they're large tortillas, it's only 80 calories, and I think they're fantastic. And so I recommend you try them. Um, I think you can buy them at just a regular grocery store, too, so you don't have to get the ginormous pack that I get at Costco. But seriously, I love these. I use them for quesadillas, tacos, everything. So I recommend those. I also bought this. It's uh, Bob's Red Mill 7 Grain Hot Cereal, and I really, really, really like this. Um, it's very weedy tasting, oaty tasting, um, and it takes a little while to cook, um, but for a quarter cup of the dry mix, it's 140 calories, but it's got 6 grams of fiber, 6 grams of protein, and I mean, it's really good stuff. It's got quite a bit of wheat type things in it. Let's see if I can zoom in. Of course not. It's got uh, whole grain wheat, rye, oats, something I'm not sure what it is, um, triticale, barley, brown rice, oat bran, and flaxseed are the ingredients. So it's really good stuff. Um, it has to cook for about 10 minutes, I think. Uh, no, let's see. Yeah, you cover, cook for 10 minutes after it boils. But I really quite like it. I've been just putting a little bit of butter, a little bit of uh, brown sugar in it, and it makes for a really quite tasty breakfast. Um, I'm in love with these Bay Bell cheeses and they're quite fun and my daughter, my almost three year old, loves them. I'd open it up but I only have one hand because the other's holding the camera but uh, when you open this outside there's a little inner wax area. Maybe I'll have my husband open it so I can show you. Yeah. Hey, will you open this? I'll have him open that so I can show you guys what it is. <laughs> it's kind of fun. Um, I also wanted to show you guys this Kirkland which I shop at Costco a lot. Real egg, like finger, basically it's just egg whites. And I personally do not like these at all. I hate them. I wish I hadn't bought them at Costco. I wish I had tried egg products elsewhere because, I don't know, they're just weird. The texture's weird. They don't taste right. They don't cook right. They're just weird. In fact, the other day I tried making just, you know, scrambled eggs out of them. <coughs> and they didn't even cook. It was really weird. The pan was kind of cold when I put them on, and when I've made them before, I had the pans good and hot, but I do not love these, so I do not recommend these. I recommend using regular eggs, but I thought I would tell you guys because I did try these, and um, I heard about them on another video and was curious how they tasted and whatnot, so basically I hate them most. 
So my husband did open it, but I actually probably need him to come back. But it's just this paper. Well, maybe I can open it. So it's this little wax outer ring, and you pull on it. It's got little tabs, and you pull it open, and it's this fun little kind of will. And inside it is a little circle cheese. And I think it's Swiss, but I'm not sure. It doesn't taste really Swissy because I'm not a big Swiss cheese fan, but I really like it. So I recommend Baybell cheeses. I also bought these at Costco, but you can buy them at the regular grocery store. And um, I'll have to look and see the calories on those. Move, dog. Baybell cheese is. Oh, sorry. Looks like one piece uh, has 70 calories. And let's see, it has any protein? Five proteins in one piece. So, pretty good. Um, so, then the next thing I wanted to show you was Metamucil. I just started using this, and um, I basically hate it. It's not very tasty, and it's gritty, and it's kind of weird, but it really helps. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and keep taking it. Uh, it's only 20 calories for a teaspoon, and they recommend that you take three teaspoonfuls every day, which I feel is a bit excessive, so I do one to two a day. And also, oranges! I've been eating a lot of oranges, and they've really been helping me to avoid sweets at night. Uh, when I watch TV, I've been eating oranges because I like to snack when I watch TV, and I like it because it's giving me something to snack on, but I feel like I'm not going nuts, so I like these. But I definitely, definitely recommend the Baybell cheese and these tortillas. If you try anything out of this, those are delicious. <laughs> So yeah, but I'm basically crazy tonight. Um, I worked out earlier and I walked on my treadmill. I did a little over three miles and I walked for about an hour. And I'm getting the worst blister on my foot, on my heel. And I've tried a couple things to fix it and I just it just keeps coming back and it never heals properly because I'm trying to work out at least three times a week and I'm trying to pump it up from three. But right now three is the max I've done. But um, I'm feeling pretty good. Like I said, I'm really pumped up and I'm really excited. Uh, I've got some things I want to show you, but my baby's asleep in the room, so I cannot get in there. But I'll show you my, I, want, I have a belt that's kind of my goal to fit into. It's a really neat belt that my sister gave me, so I'll try to get on here and show you guys that next time I make a video. Um, so I'll report my weight also and let you guys know where I'm at in a few minutes.